fetal circulation. The umbilical cord consists of two umbilical artery and one umbilical vein. Mother's placenta passes the oxygenated blood via the umbilical vein to the liver of the baby, and then the blood goes to the inferior vena cover by the first bypass called as ductus venosus, and then the blood comes to the right atrium. Right atrium sends the blood to the left atrium and right ventricle. Right atrium sends the blood to the left atrium via second bypass called as foramen ovoval. Then the blood comes to the left ventricle, then the aorta. The right ventricular blood comes to the lungs of the fetus by the pulmonary artery, but the lungs are very immature. That's why the lungs return back the blood to the descending arch of aorta via the third bypass called as ductus arteriosus. And then the whole blood comes to the systemic circulation by that the umbilical arteries carries the deoxygenated blood returned back to the placenta for filtering it. Thank you very much.